Hey everyone, welcome to today's video. It's going to be on my apartment tour. I'm just going to give you guys a little tour of where I live. So I hope you guys enjoy. So this is what it looks like when you first walk in. I just have a little mat where I keep my shoes and this little table from Ikea where I keep my keys. So I'm going to show you guys my kitchen first. And this is what it looks like. It is a one bedroom apartment so there's not that much space but it's enough just for me. So that's what it looks like. I love this little island that I have because I love to cook so it comes in handy. And then I just have that one mirror for when you walk in. And this is my sink where I've been doing dishes obviously. And my pretty empty fridge um, as you'll see right now. <laughs> So this is what I have in these cabinets. Um, I cannot reach the top cabinet, so everything is kind of squished at the bottom. And I'm a huge tea drinker, so I love to keep my teas in one cabinet separate from everything else. This is all of my like cups, or not my cups, like my bowls and my plates and stuff. And I do have a little bit of a theme going on with like red and black and white, so you'll see that throughout the room as well. This is just a big glass cabinet and I keep all of my glasses and my cups in here, my wine glasses. And again, they're all squished to the first two shelves because I can't reach the other shelves. So I have washer, dryer, a little, actually no, it's a washing machine and an oven, not a washer and a dryer. I have a little Keurig machine, I love it. And I'm huge on artwork as well. I have a lot of artwork in my apartment. Uh, this one here is from Structube and it's a pretty big painting. So I have this chandelier here that I've yet to put up. But a funny story about this chandelier is when I just moved in, I actually got a knock on my door randomly one day and this random guy just handed me this huge box and he was like, hurry up, like take it. And I was like, what are you doing? Like I don't even know you and you're giving me this random thing, like, what is it? He's like, it's for you, I want you to have it, like, I stole it for you. I was like, why? Like, I don't even know who you are. Um, but yeah, he just gave it to me. It ended up being a really nice chandelier, and like, I Googled it, it was like a $700 chandelier. It's really beautiful, but I never saw that guy again, and yeah, it's just a really funny story about this chandelier, and it's gonna be hung right there. I'm just waiting for somebody to come and put it up for me. And when you go to the left of my apartment, I just have these three doors. One of them is a washer and dryer, the next is a bathroom, and another is my closet with my shoes in them. That's it. So this is my shoe collection, uh, just my running shoes. All of my heels and stuff are at my other house. I just don't have enough room for them here. So these are what I wear on a kind of regular basis. I just have some Jordans and like sneakers and stuff and some running shoes. So please forgive me, these are not cleaned, but this is basically all that I have at this house. So these ones right here are a gift from my boyfriend and the rest I purchased myself. And I'm a size three and a half kids, which is pretty sad. I have really small feet. Yeah. So since I live in Canada and it's really cold here in the winter time, I have a massage jacket and it's super super warm and it's really pretty. And I just have some pillows and a sewing machine up there. If you guys didn't know, I do sew and I am in fashion school so that's why that's there. And this is my washroom right here and it's so weird, like I don't know why the switch is on the outside of the hallway, <laughs> but whatever, it's pretty stupid. So I have a sink, toilet, and just a piece of my artwork here that I made and I just kind of like to hang them around my condo. Um, I made this about a year ago and I love it. I get so many compliments when people come over. But yeah, it's really cute. So when you open these drawers here, it's all of my like essential skincare and hair care products and hair tools so I like to keep it all organized in one spot 
and in this drawer here is all of my hair extensions. I have my Bellamy hair extensions right in the first little section there and then the second ones. I'm not too sure where those came from, <laughs> but I know that I did cut them and I did ruin them, so I don't wear them anymore. And can we just take a second to see how cute my socks are? These were a gift from my boyfriend as well, and I just think they're so cute. Like, how cute is Pikachu? He's just so happy all the time. <laughs> so this is my shower and my bathtub. I do use Moroccan oil hair shampoo and conditioner I love it and that's my shower head it's a quick shower video so once we walk into the living area I just have my big red couch and my floor to ceiling windows which I love I have this big fuzzy rug I got it from HomeSense and I love it and yeah this kind of goes with the red theme it's the red couch is kind of like a signature piece in my apartment and this cute little bear that I like to keep on the couch just because he's comfortable to cuddle with when I'm watching TV. And I have another piece of artwork here. This is from Structube as well. And just kind of ties in with the red and black theme that I have going on. And this table right here is from Structube as well. It's just a glass table. It's kind of to give the illusion of invisible space so it doesn't look too cluttered just because I'm not working with a lot of space. And this cabinet right here, I'm not sure where I got this from, but I just keep my homework and all of my paintings and stuff in there from school. And I have my little TV. And I also have a balcony, so this is my view, and sorry that my windows are so dirty, they need to come and clean them, and nobody's cleaned them yet, and it's always dirty. But this patio furniture is from Inside Out Patio in Toronto, and I love it. These cushions will never get dirty. You can bleach them and it will just come right out and will not ruin them. So they're super good fabric. I absolutely love them. So check them out. And this is my view. I'm not going to tell you guys where it is. But yeah, it's pretty cool. So now we're going to go into my bedroom. And this is where I film my videos. And yeah, just is where I sleep. <laughs> I love my bedroom. This painting right here is more of like a poster. Um, I got it at Ikea. It was for under 50 bucks, 100% under 50, but it was maybe like $30. And it's really, really pretty. And it also ties in with the theme that I have going on. I just have my computer on my bed and my little phone. And this mirror right here is from HomeSense, and I love it as well. And this is my little makeup studio, so I just kind of sit here and film for you guys. And I'm trying to find a different layout, but I'm not sure. That's where I have all my makeup. And under there, I just have a little stereo system that I've kind of set up for when I'm bored and listening to music. This is my camcorder that I use to film sometimes. And all my makeup brushes, my fake flower from Ikea, and my little mirror and then my lights when it's dark in my room these get super bright so I broke two light bulbs already so I'm kind of working with what I have and this is where I keep all of my makeup so if you guys want me to do like an in-depth makeup collection I will but it's gonna take way too long for this video so I'm just gonna speed this part up yeah. So going into my closet here, I guess I, it's really messy, I'm so sorry, but I don't have a lot of clothes, I just have a lot of jeans. Um, that's basically all that's in my closet and a bunch of messy boxes. So I have my school bag here from Gucci, I have a Michael Kors bag or purse that was a Christmas gift for my boyfriend and then another Michael Kors school bag that I use for school sometimes when I don't want to carry around a big knapsack. And this is where I keep all of my tops and my shirts and a little bit more makeup as well. And lastly, this is just a painting that I've done. Um, and this is my bedroom. And yeah, it's just another piece that I like to showcase in my house and goes with my color scheme as well. So 
that is all for my apartment tour. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you in my next video.